A business car was the height of luxury when traveling on the railroad. Operated by the railroads for the purpose of their officers, these cars had everything that was needed for somebody offer an officer of the railroad to look at the railroad and travel around and basically keep an eye on their property. This car is number 105 from the Union Pacific, donated to the Western Pacific Railroad Museum. Let's have a look on board to see what it's about. Journeys on the railroad in a private car could go a long ways, including overnight journeys. Through these doors were the compartments where the different officials on board got to spend their time sleeping. When staying aboard the car, the various people on board stayed in a series of staterooms that are along this hallway. The first one next to me here is the simplest of them and is more like a typical Pullman compartment of those days. As we move further down the car, we get to progressively better rooms that are more and more luxurious. One of them is going to be the compartment used by whoever the senior official on board was. One of them was an office used by probably the secretary of the official on board. And then through the doors ahead of me was probably the culmination of the private car, business car experience, the lounge. So when it comes to a private business car, nothing says luxury as much as the lounge located at the rear end of the car. Here in this space, the railroad would entertain their officials and their guests, and the senior officer would sit at his desk. With a view out the back, and a clock, a speedometer, and the railroad air uh, brake pipes, the officer would also have located here controls operating lights that would shine out the back to illuminate the track, allowing them to see the track unrolling behind them. Beyond that is an open platform, and Nothing says private car any more than a, pro than a platform on which you could stand and watch the railroad going by. And finally, from the rear platform, probably not the best place to be when you're going by quickly, but at any moderate speed, gives you a wonderful view of the entire railroad. That concludes our tour of Business Car 105 here at the Western Pacific Railroad Museum. We've done our best to show you what it's like, but it's always worth a visit to, our, to the museum here in Portola.